So good morning everybody. This time I'm going to talk about the economic situation in France, especially the crisis and a little of my life. So how um, the crisis, how has the crisis affected it? So first I would like to talk about the unemployment which has risen a lot and the number of jobs uh, which has decreased on the opposite. Um, the population most concerned by uh, the crisis is the young and I am especially concerned since I, you know, I'm looking for a job and I have only rare opportunities. Um, I would like to talk about um, the reforms uh, the government implemented and the fact that they have launched some plans to stimulate economy um, and youth employment too, but it's it's harder to it's difficult to to get a job. Um, I would like to to make an aside concerning um, the bad social climate in some companies. I'm talking about uh, the suicides of desperate people who lost their jobs. Um, for example, in the company France Telecom. Uh, in the second point, I would like to talk about uh, the prices of staples, uh, which has risen too, like the price of bread, the price of meat, uh, vegetable, fruits and vegetables, and the fuel as well, uh, which has undergone a lot of vagaries for the last month. Uh, advertising campaigns um, which tell the society to eat at least five fruits and vegetables a day. Um, I think this advice can be um, followed by the people since they have to keep an eye on their uh, budget. So it's difficult for them. Then, uh, nowadays we live in an overconsumption system. Uh, the society encourages uh, people to purchase more and more things um, even if the crisis has mitigated this phenomenon. Uh, as a consequence people are trapped by the trading system. Uh, I'm talking about the advertising, um, invasive uh, advertising and promotions always more and more tempting. Uh, I would like to make a comment about the retailers uh, who incentive strongly people to purchase. Um, so the more consumers uh, purchase, the more they identify with the products and feel happier. And here is the problem, here is the trap. Um, they, they begin to, to ask for some credits and revolving credits. Uh, they live in an unreal world where everything is affordable for them. So some people live beyond their means. Uh, they only see the nice part of the credits, but they forget that we have to pay off. So now let me talk about um, my life, in fact. Um, you know, nowadays I'm looking for a job and um, companies have very tight budgets, so they proposed uh, very low wages. It's very difficult to to find a well-paid job and it's harder for me since I have only a little experience. Uh, concerning what I spend my money on, uh, I spend my money on mainly things like food, fuel for my car, uh, for the rent, for electricity and other things. I'm someone who saves money on a lot of things and I'm not spendthrift. And to conclude, I will tell you, I will talk about the things I had to forego. Uh, actually, nothing except uh, some purchase, purchase of clothes, but it makes my boyfriend happy since, um, according to him, I have enough clothes to put on. <laughs> so my presentation is over. Um, don't forget to make comments on the videos and <laughs> wish me a happy birthday tomorrow. <laughs> See you later.